Hi, Chuck Vincent, please. Who's calling? It's Alan Adrian. Hi. Good. How you doing? Good. Great. Yeah. So what you been up these days? Uh, a little bit, a little of this and that. Um, did you want to get together this week? Sure. Good. What's a good night day? What'd you say? What's a good, what's a good day? Uh, that's just about any day. Uh, Wednesday's probably good. Tomorrow's probably good. Yeah, oh, tomorrow yeah. is. Okay. How's uh, how's uh, Wednesday? That's fine. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Okay, great. I'll see you then. Great. Bye. Bye. Hello. Hi, John. Hi. Did you call him? Yeah, I did. What happened? Uh, we set up an appointment for Thursday uh -huh. morning. Good. Um. No, the reason I was asking, what does he do? I mean, I know you told me he's an agent, he's but... An he's a yeah. agent. Yeah, I mean, the reason I was asking that is, is it okay or not okay to bring my usual portfolio? Uh, you can ask him for porn work. Okay, so it's okay to bring it. Yeah, I guess so. Let me, I'll double check with Joe. But, no, uh, yeah. As far, and unless I tell you otherwise, it is uh, okay. Okay, good. So if you find out otherwise, leave a message on my machine if I'm not here. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, uh, no, I, I'm i assuming that because he lines up porn flicks all the time. That's interesting because I haven't really heard of him before. So he's a legit agent. Yeah, that's why, I guess. Something else oh, interesting has happened uh, also. Um, well, I went to the AFAA trade show on Friday. Yeah, it was all tied up. Yeah. Um, the trade show was on Friday only, yeah. Saturday was uh, board meetings and things which were closed to yeah. people like us. So, uh, um, and when I was there, I met Chuck Vincent. Uh, I've met, I've seen Chuck Vincent a few times before. I mean, I came into a, I was on a set once as an extra. When he opened, when he opened his mouth, he realized. What? Do you know who he is? Yeah, of course I know who he is. Besides roommates? Of course, yeah. I've actually seen uh, one or two of his movies when I was a kid. That's how long he's been around. Porn movies? Hardcore? Yeah. yeah. He was doing that when you were a kid? Yeah. Well, anyway, I think he's he's gay, right? Very. There's a $3 bill. A $3 bill? Yeah, extremely, extremely so. Wow. I mean, uh, didn't he strike you that way? No, I, I'm only going from what I heard. He didn't really strike me as that good. My friend Stroh Wiseman used to work with him. We used to work with all those people, Ron Jeremy. You know, he's doing he's doing ad campaigns for Hollywood movies now, and he's also going to publish with his own express. But, uh, you know, he knew Chuck and all these people from years ago. I see. That's what he, he told me about uh, Chuck. Hmm. This is one of the most ironic things about Chuck Vincent. Uh, he's very obviously. Well, anyway, um, when I saw him on Friday and we were talking for a short time, he suggested I call him this week uh, for us to get together. So I did. Yeah. And uh, he, we just set up a time, and which is 5:30. Yeah. Uh, so it's not the usual type of thing coming into his office during the day. Okay. It's uh, you got the, you got the hint then. Well, I get the idea, yeah. Yeah, right, just be prepared, you know. <laughs> I know, but yeah, what, yeah. what's ironic is I've got two in a row. This one with Chuck and this other one you told me about that I've set up with Richard for Thursday. Richard is not a very aggressive person, from what I understand. <clears throat> so this uh, is going to be quite a gay weekend for me. <laughs> calm down. You know you like it. Stop playing gays. I'll get through okay, I guess. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I... Uh, I wouldn't be, I don't know what Chuck Vincent, maybe he just has work for you. But I mean, I'm just going, well, it's probably know, a combination of both. Life, I don't know what the guy's private life is like, like, you know, Chris Covino, too. Right. I mean, what somebody does in their private life and what, and what you know what I mean? You know what I mean? It doesn't always overlap. Yeah, Chris has never tried to rape me. Okay, so, uh, you know, maybe Chuck just wants to talk with you if he does have some work for you. 
Yeah, probably, but he it's probably a situation where he'll he's feeling things out himself too and you know. We'll just, you know, play it by ear. I that's exactly. I can help you with him cuz that's all I know about him is that is that don't I mean don't dread it or anything. No, 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 I'm not dreading. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's I don't know, it's play playing the game. I mean, roommates is has got a good review in Variety, so I'd like to get in one of his films. Yeah, that's also that's the soft version of it, because Variety won't review hardcore. I bet you didn't know that. Uh, I'm not yeah. surprised at all. No, I'm not surprised. They said they, said they uh, things like Caligula, of course, but uh, roommates had to show them the softcore version for the re- for review because it's verboten. Uh, for them to review hardcore because if they review one hardcore movie like 30 other people go here's a, a Veronica hard picture it's a real breakthrough blah 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 so on and so forth yes I want to see roommates yeah I saw part of it did you see the part with the Jamie in it yeah where he masturbated over this girl who had been raped yes, yes. I can't wait to see that it was good and it's all done continuously in other words he starts there's no cuts at all. It's yeah. all one continuous shot. Oh, that's great. He's masturbating, and then he finally comes. It's great. Though I was I'm impressed by you know Jamie's control over it to be able to just. <laughs> I'm serious. Like well, I'm serious though. I mean, Mark Stevens and Jamie—they're both much better than I am at that because they can. They can turn themselves on and off like waterfall. Right, and come at a certain time. I mean. They'll time things so that they... I'll tell you, I'll tell you a secret, Mr. Moser. What? I could do that, too. You can do it, too. Good for you. Thank you. So why don't you be a stand-in cock, then? Right. <laughs> no, I mean, there's some, some aspects of my personality are very funny. You know, I can't exactly go into them here, but uh, there's some, there's some uh, amusing aspects of my personality. Hmm. Okay, well, thanks for giving me... I'll find out. You want me to ask around about Chuck Vincent? Oh, I don't think it's necessary. I, I'll do it. I mean... Uh, Who would you ask? Two or three people. Nobody nobody, nobody that's going to call them up and, and uh, say anything. Who would they be? Maybe like your partner in... Yeah, maybe my partner. Uh, maybe some people who don't deal with him directly now. If you want, it's not necessary. If you feel like it, I mean, don't. No, because I could tell you're panicking. About it. <laughs> I, could, I, could tell, I could tell, you know. Yeah. Also, the thing with Richard is he, uh, like I said, he tends to be, uh, from what I understand, very unaggressive, you know. Oh yeah, well that's that's good news. So. You know what I mean? Because he, the thing is, he might want to, but uh, I, I don't know how direct he is. Mm-hmm. All right, uh, I'll talk to you later, all right? Okay. Okay, John? Good. All right, bye. Bye.